Well, hello my friends. I figured I would vlog today. It's April 2nd. So um, it's actually pretty late in the day. It's like six o'clock. But I wanted to just kind of show you guys what I've been doing today. I just posted a video. It's my closet organization clean with me. I'll put it down below for you guys. Um, so yeah, I haven't left to go and do my selling of the clothes. I explain it in the video. But um, I'm going to do that at some point. But check out these bags, y'all. Like, ba -blam. They are like chocked both full of clothing. And it's just clothes. It doesn't have shoes. It doesn't have handbags. It's just clothing. Like, what? So... My closet looks a little bit different now. I figured I'd show you because I figured something something fun to show. Um, so yeah, I didn't actually leave the house today because it was snowing. So I was like, nah, I'll just do it another day. No big deal. No big deal, right? Let's go into the master and see what we have to talk about. So there's my closet now. I, it's kind of whittled down a little bit. I actually, when I was doing the video, um, here are just some like options for tops for my trip that's coming up um, in less than a month now to uh, Austin, Texas. So that should be fun. But look at all the hangers I have now. Oh my gosh. So yeah, here's my new closet situation. So much more space. And I even whittled this stuff down too. This is kind of like my casual wear. This is like obviously all the stuff I've been wearing currently. Um, so yeah. And then I've got some pajamas over here and then some other pants. But yeah, that's, that's what's going on in the closet situation. So that actually happened today. I was planning on doing this last week, but then it just didn't end up working out. And um, also last weekend, I was supposed to be doing my um, like document organization. And let me tell you, document organization. Um, I like need to be in the mood for that kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, yee. That document organization project is going to be the death of me, I swear. <laughs> it is like a lot because I need to get all of my stuff in order and just kind of like sprawl it out. And I'm just not sure the best way to do it. I'm just not sure. I got some bills today. Yay, I get to pay those. And then I've got my list. I have several lists of things I've got to deal with. Um, I actually have to go buy stuff, guys. Crazy, right? Um, I have a dirty mug here that I can put in the sink because my stuff in the dishwasher is currently drying. Actually, it's all done. Oh, I like to like, do you guys do this? I like to open up my dishwasher and like let it like air out a little bit because it's just like so like, ugh. like it's so hot, you know? I don't know, I like to do that. Is that weird? It's probably weird. We went on our walk and he was very upset because it had snowed again. So he doesn't like it when it snows because he can't smell his smells. Doyle, are you gonna come over here and say hi to your friends? Oh, here he comes. Come on over, boo boo. Come on over. Oh, la 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 la. Hi, Doyle Dog. Hi, Doyle Dog. What's going on, poo poo? Yeah? <gasps> uh oh. Who's texting you, Doyle? Who's texting you? Who's texting you? Oh, so you know how I don't really have like a lot of things on my walls because I'm like afraid of everything? I think I have an idea and I think I like it, but you guys tell me what you think. So um, uh, let me turn you around and then I'll go over what I'm gonna talk about. I've got this little table thing, right? And like obviously the things that are on top of the table need to just kind of like go away. But I have this cool star that I got at Target quite a while ago. And I was originally thinking of putting that like right about there so i was thinking about doing that and i'm like eh, i've been like letting it sit there for many many months and i'm just like not 100 percent feeling it but i remembered i have this like head thing from the previous owner and he originally had it up there 
um, in the like on that huge wall and I don't want to put really I don't know I'm really like not big and keen on putting anything on those walls right there because it's just like such a pain in the butt but I was thinking about hanging this guy up here I think that would look kind of cool with this like ship lappy kind of look and um, I mean I know it's kind of like white on white but then he's got like the burlap things around his horns and then the horns are darker I don't know what do you guys think let me know in the comments if I should do the head or if I should do the star up there. I don't really know, but I'm kind of leaning towards the head just because it's more interesting, I feel like. But I'm not 100% sure, but I'm like 80% sure I want to do the head because I think that would be cool. But yeah, so that's like what I got going on today. But I haven't fully decided on the like decor situation because you know me i haven't put anything up because i'm like afraid and my mom forced me to put that thing up right there above the tv the day i moved in so yeah um so yeah i'm gonna have some dinner i still haven't gone out to the grocery store yet which i'm sure a lot of you thought that i'd be like clamoring to go to the grocery store yesterday because it was the first but i did not and um today i just uh, I didn't leave today just well it was snowing and um, I wanted to get that closet uh, like clean with me thing done and get that edited and uploaded for you guys now the next big project is that document organization which crazy right it's just a lot I have like documents in my garage I have documents in my like office space I've got documents kind of all over the place I've got them in my kitchen I'm like looking at some documents like I uh, I think you'll feel well obviously I'll feel like way better when it's all done but it's just like wrapping your mind around it and figuring out like what you want to keep what you want to file separately like what you want to like, like keep all together I don't know it's just like there's a lot of decisions and sometimes you just get like decisioned out hence not putting things up on the wall <laughs> oh my gosh but anyway um i think i'm gonna eat a little bit of dinner oh my uh, battery light's flashing now so awesome um i'm gonna eat a little bit of dinner but i will check in with you guys in a little while and uh let you know anything else fun that's going on in my day but i just wanted to vlog because i missed you guys and um i will uh see you guys in just a moment well hey again <laughs> it is almost time for my dinner to be done but i wanted to show you guys what i was having for dinner um, basically probably because I'm going through withdrawals of not showing you what I'm having for dinner <laughs> But it's one of the meals that was in my freezer before and it's by Bremer It is the Bremer every day. Sorry. It's the lasagna with meat sauce. So yeah um, I opened it up. It was a freezer meal. I got this from Aldi um, You pop it in the freezer. Oh, you pop it in the oven. Sorry uh, at 375 for 50 minutes and um, so it said it had like mozzarella on the top. And to be honest, I think I counted like eight to 10 actual like little pieces of grated mozzarella cheese. So I took matters into my own hands and I put mozzarella cheese on the top of it because who doesn't like cheese besides lactose intolerant people? And I feel you lactose intolerant people. I'm sorry for you. Um, so this is what I'm having. It should be done. Let me check my phone. I put my little um timer thing on two minutes and 22 seconds eee, so exciting but yeah so i will show you what it looks like because i'm super curious too and this might be like a total flop i hope not because i've waited for 50 minutes <laughs> but i hope i hope it's good i don't know we'll have to we'll have to see that's what you get with like freezer meals sometimes is that you just don't really know if it's going to be good or not right doyle Okay. Look at that face. You're a cute one, Doyle. You're a cute one. That's basically what he does all day, by the way. He doesn't do much. He's just chilling. And like, it hasn't smelled like lasagna at all in here until probably about three minutes ago. It started really smelling like lasagna. So I was like, yeah, let's do this thing. But I am going to, I feel like it's going to be messy, so I'm going to get a bowl. <laughs> I know lasagna is traditionally served on a plate, but I'm going to serve it in a bowl because it's like normally those layers, they kind of like, I feel like they always slide around. I don't know if there's like a better way to do it, 
but got my trusty fork and my bowl <laughs> I'll put it in there <laughs> oh my goodness is it's gonna be just another minute or so I'm gonna take this thing out of the oven and then I will show you what it looks like I'll also give you a little uh, review if it's good or not I don't even know if they have them at Aldi anymore but um who knows some of their freezer stuff is kind of like seasonal they just get it and then once it's gone it's gone and then they get new stuff but sometimes it's there all the time i don't know i have no idea it just looked good so i was like all right well i'm just gonna buy this and I'm, i don't even remember how much it was it's been in my freezer um gosh for at least a few months now i'm not really sure but um anyway i will cut to a clip of me showing you oh it's all done now so let's take it out of the oven i'll be right back all right so here is what it looks like um, all done, but it said to give it two minutes to kind of like cool off a little bit and then I will show it to you guys once it is actually in that bowl. I'll be right back. All right, so here is the lasagna goodness. The layers are there. It wasn't too hard getting it out. Um, sometimes it's like the first one is always the most difficult to get out of the pan. But let me do a taste test. All right, basically it's like part of the noodle. Looks like a couple little chunks of meat and the cheese I put on the top because there wasn't really any cheese on it. So let's try it. I have like a piece of hair stuck. It's pretty all right. It could be definitely more meaty. Here's what the noodle looks like. It's like a wavy, a wavy noodle. It's pretty all right. And the sauce is okay too. I'll give it a thumbs up for a frozen meal. It's pretty good. But anyway, I'm gonna start eating this and um, you know, dinner it up here. And then I will check in with you guys in a little while. Bye. We didn't tell them what we're giving away. All the new releases. All the new one releases. of all the new releases is what we're giving away. We didn't say that. We didn't so I am currently watching. I will turn it down a little bit. I am currently watching um, Coffee Break Planner. I will put a link below to their Etsy shop as well as um, the Facebook group. It's I believe it's a closed Facebook group, but they do lives usually Monday nights. They they'll like announce it. So right now they're doing a giveaway for their new releases. Um, I hopped on after I got off of the phone with my mom, so I don't even know what the new releases are, but um, that's what they're doing at the moment. But I think I'm going to say goodbye for today. It is 8.39 currently, and um, I'm gonna jump back into the little chatty chat with uh, Coffee Break Planner. So I hope you guys are having a great day. Feel free to thumbs up the video if you liked it and also hit the subscribe button. You can hit the bell notifications when I post new videos. I'm not really on a schedule, so I highly recommend hitting the little bell because it will send you an email when I do an upload and then you can decide if you want to watch it or not. So I will see you guys very, very soon with some more riveting content. I'll talk to you later. Bye guys.